authors should read the journal, right? Go through um, a couple of years of the journal and read articles. I guess the second related piece of advice we would have would be when possible to cite relevant articles from the journal. We'd probably add, the third thing we'd probably add would be, if possible, review for the journal. We're always looking for reviewers, frankly, and it's a great service, but it's also a way to understand sort of the kinds of things we're looking for. My top piece of advice to first-time authors is to do peer debriefing before submission. In other words, share the manuscript with colleagues to help tighten up the argument. Colleagues who have published before can help the author anticipate some potential criticisms. I would add that it's important to conform to the author submission guidelines of the journal. They're there for a reason. Uh, don't up, end up with a desk reject from the editorial office just because the manuscript fails to conform to the formatting standards. The first thing I ask authors, very frequently they have to revise their introduction because uh, what happens is they say, if, I mean, you know, these people are just beginning to sort of understand that they have a voice on the basis of the strengths of their research and the data and um, that they really have a good, uh, good grasp over things, but they sometimes couch it in different places in the article. So very frequently I would, um, I'd, uh, you know, ask authors if they can revise the introduction. Sometimes this is right off the bat, uh, you know, in the beginning. And um, sometimes it comes from reviewers as well. So I compile my comments and then tell them, you are, please pay attention to, you know, taking these statements um, and reflect them for in the beginning of the article. That's one. And the second thing is sometimes they're unsure of uh, the fit uh, for the piece. So if this is an appropriate piece for uh, the other journal, right? Because every journal has its own uh, unique selling proposition and its niche. So we want to make sure that we publish in these niches broadly, which is sort of an oxymoronic statement, but you, I, I guess like we stand for different things as a AAA journal. So uh, I would I'd ask them to check, you know, have these kinds of issues been covered or is the particular issue he or she is dealing with or they're dealing with, um, um, you know, is the tangentially related to something you've published before? So to incorporate, you know, build on those, we would like to see an engagement with our previous publications on similar topics to see where the novelty of this piece uh, stands. That helps both editors, reviewers, and in the end, uh, the authors as well. 